So it's the weekend and I am off to visit clients in jail. Going to visit somebody in the jail is such a pain in the butt from a defense attorney standpoint. It's probably the equivalent of going to get through the airport to get on a flight. You got to go through security, you got to get signed in, you got to show your ID, you got to take off your belt, um, can't have your cell phone with you. Once you get into the jail, you got to go to um, the proper building. Once you get to the proper building, then you got to be escorted by a corrections officer up to the holding area. Then you got to wait in that holding area, the interview area, where they're going to bring the guy down to talk to you. And um, chairs aren't comfortable. You don't have a phone. It takes 30, 45 minutes. Sometimes you even get into the, the spot to meet the guy. Huge pain in the butt. Something else I want to talk about at jail is while I was there, um, I had the opportunity to see a couple of people being bonded out, probably on less serious traffic charges or minor charges, whatever they were. Seeing their excitement about getting out of jail is great. You know, they're happy to get out of jail, but they have no idea, for the most part, what's in store for them in the criminal charge and all the court paperwork and um, court appearances and the degree of stress that the criminal charge is going to have on their life over the next upcoming months. So when people walk out of jail, they tend to have this sense of relief because their instant gratification of, I'm finally out, is satisfied. And they kind of rest back and get easy and they forget that they need to take active steps pretty quick and hire an attorney because there's a lot more stuff that needs to be done. Getting out of jail is just the first step in the process. So that's my tip for the day. If you get arrested for whatever reason, Consult with an attorney as soon as you get out of jail or shortly, a day or so after you get out of jail. Don't sit back and wait for your arraignment because there's a lot of stuff that can be done in between um, arraignment or when you get out of jail and that first court appearance to start working on your case. Best of luck. God bless.